Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of A Whole New War. I'm here with Owen, we're game with the cooler, and we're gonna throw down another 75 point game of War Machine. Now today, I'm playing Menoth, and you're playing... Garbage. Garbage, <laughs> terrible. I'm playing Signar. Signar, you're playing Menoth. Bad Signar. Who is it, Nero 2, Nero 3? Three? 3. Three. Nemo. Lightning Nero. Nero. I hope he's Nero. Nero. He's in your hands, he's he Nero. He abuses Finch. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to be playing Extraction right. from Steamroller 2016. Now, Extraction is a two objectives, two flags mission, um, and I'll be playing Amon Al Raza, who is my first time. Yeah, I got to get him. I have a plan now. Yeah, he was just took a look at my arm. He's like, I want to do this, but I want to go even further. He's going to take it to the logical conclusion. Yeah. I took it to the like these are the models I have painted conclusion. Owen wants to take it to the logical skew conclusion that is yeah. Owen. Yeah. So w look for this army in the future in Owen's hands, except probably way, way skewed, way it's super skewed. As many models. It is, yeah, yeah, it is. It's almost as many models. It would be, uh, be four more jacks. Yeah. <laughs> There'd be four <laughs> extra jacks to the six jacks I have right now. So anyway, let's take a look at the models. We'll take a look at the uh, table setup for extraction and we'll get this underway. And here is Owen's 75 points of Signar. We've got... Nemo 3, Nemo three. Finch, and Reinhold. And you are allowed to do this now. She, They're a unit. It didn't stop me. That's anymore. right. So we don't know if War Room is legit here, but War Room allowed him to add Reinhold to this list yep. as an attachment for Nemo, even with Finch there. So that's the first battle group. We've got a... Centurion, a Hammersmith, a Defender, and a Minuteman. Nice. And then we've got two baby battle groups. So we've got... Um, I don't remember her name, and Jake's. Uh, Hunter, Jake's, Jake's Allison yeah. Jake's, and Allison Jake's, Junior and a Defender, and then we have um, Harlan Bursch. Yeah. Yeah, you checked out my Harlan Bursch, and you're all jealous, now you've got Harlan Bursch. So there it is, we've got 75 points of Signar. And here's my 75 points of Menoth. I've got Alraza right here, Amon. Uh, in his battle group, we have three Crusaders. Um, we have the um, Krios Character Jack, Blessing of Vengeance. Blessing uh, of Vengeance? No, it's... Um, Fire of Salvation. Fire of Salvation, that's the one. Yeah, yeah, Fire of Salvation. The character Crusader. Then we have a Templar, a Redeemer, um, and a unit attachment of a Hierophant. Outside the battle group, we have a Choir, Min Choir, Min, um, Temple Flame Guard, Solo Posse of two Exemplar Seneschals, a um, Mechanic, a Vassal, and three Racks. That's my 75 points of Menoth. And here's our four foot table set up for extraction. There is two objectives. Um, they are going to be worth one control, or sorry, one point. Point, that's right, yeah, that's control point. One, one CP basically if they're destroyed, and you can only damage them after the end of the second player's second turn. Um, and then we have two flags which can be controlled for one or dominated for two. Yeah, sorry, start of second player, second turn you can damage those guys. So rolling off right now for first player, and we go again. I win, so I will choose to go second. I'll take this side, and you can deploy first. And we're deployed. I've got Rack, 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 Crusader, Templar, Hierophant with Raza. We've got the Bless, no, Fire of Salvation. Uh, two more Crusaders and the Redeemer. Then we've got Choir, Mechanic, and the Vassal. Across here, we've got a unit of Flame Guard with two Exemplar Seneschals. Signar's line, AD Hunter uh, with Jake's. We've got Versh, we've got Junior with a Defender, we've got Nemo 3 with um, his little goblin buddy, Reinhold. maybe legally, maybe not, Centurion, Defender, Hammersmith, and then up front we've got the Minuteman. So there it is, first turn is going to Signar, allocations. For free? Uh, I don't have enough focus to power them all up, but I'm not giving them any more. So yeah, everybody's got Everybody gets one. Uh, first up, Jakes is going to go, she's going to spend three and put Sidekick onto her Hunter. And then she's just going to advance six. Psychic gives him plus two defense, and if he's base to base with her, another plus two defense for her. And then Hunter's going to run ten. He's got extended control, so he can be eight inches away from her and still work. Sixteen, actually, yeah, because it's double her, and she's a uh, eight. Yeah. Uh, next up, we're going to have his <coughs> defender run. He's just going to run up to there. And Junior's going to go. He is going to put Arcane Shield onto his buddy Nemo and Finch, because it goes on the unit, and then it just advance. He's got one left, and then it's over to the battle line. Yep, Nemo and Finch are gonna go. Finch is just going to advance. Uh, They're a unit, so he'll have to advance at the same time. Yeah. Magic time. We're going to put up Electrify on the Minuteman. We're going to put up uh, Magnetic field on. Oh, I can't have both. So I'm not going to do that. I want to keep Arcane Shield. And then we're going to put Lightning Shroud on this guy. 
three. Three left, yep. Oh. Run, Riney. Minuteman's gonna run. Big guys are gonna run. And that's turn. I forgot about Versh. He's gonna run. Yay. To there. All right, Jacks are all powered up, and it's now aimoning time. Uh, but we're gonna start with Mr. Uh, Hierophant. So he's gonna walk five. Do what this guy does, and then harmoniously exalt his best friend in the whole world, Mr. Raza. Mr. Raza's gonna go. Um, he is speed six. Uh, so he's gonna start off by doing mobility, which will cost him two, because of the greatness that is the Hierophant. He's then going to move his six, oops, like so. He's gonna cast Fortify on this Crusader. Sitting on two for the rest, um, and then we're gonna start doing some moves and runs. Uh, let's do, oh, I don't know, let's say this little fella. Uh, no, we're gonna do the Vassal first. Vassal's gonna move, he's gonna move five, over like so. And then he's going to empower this little jack. Little jack's going to activate. He's going to go... Does he want to go yet? No, he doesn't want to go yet, actually. We're just going to start running some other dudes. We're going to run Fortify Jack first. He'll run 12. Because his speed is currently uh, under mobility. So he's going to get to there. And then four more. He's going to put him up here. He doesn't want to go all the way. He just wants to go there. Speed good right now because of Raza's mobility. And that was his focus. We're going to take this Crusader. He's going to run as well. 12. So eight. And then four more is lots of room to move up into base to base, like so. Fire Salvation's gonna activate. He's gonna run his 12, like so. Templar's gonna activate. He's gonna run as well, eight, and then four more. Go hang out in behind. Crusader's gonna go. He's gonna run and just go hang out right here. We're gonna activate. Um, we are going to make an advance, six. Six. Head six over to here. And then six over to here. Uh, we're gonna do no shooting. Um, so on affecting him, it'll affect him. It's not gonna quite reach to there. Um, he'll have it if not quite able to reach this guy either. So these two jacks not able to be shot because of passage. Uh, next up, we're going to activate this little fella. He's going to move his six. Seven. Oh, seven, that's right. Yeah, yeah, he's not speed four. He's a fast robot. I'm pretty he's sure Fire go... is speed five as well. No, he's a crusader, so he's not. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's five. Okay, well, look. Uh, we're going to dial some shots this little fella at Versh. Looking for under three for blasts. Um, so it's going to be from the direction of white. So four to six. It's going to miss everything. Next one. Uh, that's going to be one. four to the one. Yeah. And then three, three to the five, so it's going to blast him. Yes. We'll boost it. It's up six, need 11. That's not going to do it. That's three. a total of nine, three damage. Last mechanic's going to go. He's just going to run. Uh, go stick himself over here. Well, thing we're going to activate. They're going to run 12, six, and then four. We're also just going to spread out. And then these two fellows are going to run. Go hang out nearby. My turn one. Maintenance phase turn two for Signar. What are we going to do? Uh, one upkeep like, like well, this one. Yep. Finch upkeeps the other one for free. Sounds good. We're going to upkeep uh, Arcane Shield and we'll allocate uh, the other two. So he's got three total. Three. Yep. I uh, would just give him one because he doesn't need the other one. Okay. Keep. And then she'll allocate one. So he's sitting at two and she's on one. Two, actually, because she's a four journeyman. Yep. Uh, this one, Finch is still good, so he's going to allocate one, which will bring him up to three, because Finch gives me an additional one. Yep. And I guess he'll do the same thing for the big guy here. So he's at three for reasons that I don't, can't explain. Because he can't use them all. <laughs> Centurion's going to move. Walk here, then say no charging him. Yep. So he's going to polarity shield. Then we're gonna do other stuff with other guys. Shoot some guns. Range ten on Versh, right? Ah, uh, yes. He's out of range there. Just quad iron into these guys. Get three of them, maybe. Looks like yeah. So he'll advance six to there. He's gonna dial up some shots. Sounds good. Three. Yep. Uh, first shot. He'll try and shoot the farthest one there. Okay. 
I don't know if they're still Def 13. They might not be. Yep, they're 13. They're 13. still 13, yeah, because they dropped the Iron Fang, so I wasn't sure about the Templar. Yep, 13, 13. So I believe I need a 7 to hit. Uh, rat 6. Rat 6, yep. Yep, 7. Cranks it. Cranks it. Arm uh, 13. Takes off 3. Kills him. Dead. He gets mad. He gets mad. Second shot. Hits. Kills. Okay, so promotion. Yep. And then last one into this guy. Hits. Hits. No. Nope. Fails. This defender's just going to aim. Trying to kill this guy. That guy. That's a good plan. Def of 12, because he's a knight. Def 13. 13? Unless he went down. He probably went down. Let's actually, just check. I think. Let's I think just he check. Went down. He's 12, yeah. Yeah. Yep, so you hit him. Hit him. Uh, pow 15. You I got it. the damage. Dice. Oh, dice minus 2, sorry. So yep. 7. Goes to the dying. So he's in the dying state. Knock down. Do it again. And this guy, uh, 7 goes to 9. I don't need to aim. Nope. So he'll just slide back. 6 goes to 8 goes to 10. 9, 10, 11. Uh, I'm just gonna shoot him. Free. Okay. I'll aim. Boost to hit. Okay. Rat nine needs a three. Gets yes, it. it. Uh, your armor fifteen. So eight goes to eight plus two. So it's dice minus four. Okay. Boosted. Four damage. Lose by one. Jigs. She is going to cast nothing yet. She's okay. gonna advance a bit, and then she's gonna cast energizer for two. So my warjack gets to move two inches. And he's just going to put himself out of threat range of that fella there. Take a move, sight. yep. So she's going to go energize behind the wall. Yep. Or the uh, pillar, rather. Move. Junior's going to run behind the pillar. Be safe. Defendor activating. He's going to sidestep. And move forward a little bit. Nope, we're going for Ooh. the mechanic. Going for the mechanic. Sounds good. There we go. Boost shove. Cranks, Cranks him. Boost damage. About 15. Nice. Super dicks. Uh, we've got these two left. So we're gonna little set up minute, man. the counter charge. He's gonna stand right here. Looks good. Ah, I'll go right like that. So uh, Minuteman, Caster, and Friends is left. That's right. Minuteman can't shoot and then jump. He has to jump first. That's true. Minuteman's gonna go. Okay. Walk up to this fella. He's gonna use his flak field to just hit you with a POW 12. Go for it. Uh, dice minus seven. Nothing. This one do anything? Nope. Bend one to jump. He's gonna hop backwards and sit just at four inches away. A gunshot. Uh, rat six, so he needs a four. Going into uh, is this fire salvation. Fire salvation. Okay. Cranks it. Cranks him. Boost damage. Dice minus five. Pow fourteen. Nothing. Nothing. Hits Cranks him. It. Boost it again. Dice Cranks minus five. Two to Two four. Two to four. And he's electrify. Yep. And now it's all down to Nemo and friends. He's got his little gobber as well. Uh, he's just going to move up a bit. Uh, he'll, she'll stand there. He'll stand here. I'm Reinhold. So Nemo and friends just walking forward a little bit, and that is turn. Going on to turn two, Menoth. So he'll die, because no one died in range. And then we go to control phase. Right, so powering up. We've got one, two, three... Four, five, six on Jax. All right, so upkeeping Fortify on this Crusader. I will have five focus. I'm not assigning any right now. Um, and everybody's just gotten their one from activating. So uh, we are going to start with Mr. Hierophant. Um, he is just going to take a walk. Oh, let's say over this way. Stay within five. Yeah, that's right. And then he's gonna harmonious exalt Mr. Raza. All right, so um, I'm going to activate Raza next. He's gonna feat for Union, then he's gonna pull one off this rack. Start his activation. Whoops, it does not blow up. Uh, then he's gonna spend two because of harmonious exaltation to cast mobility. So I can allocate those two. We're gonna give both of them to Fire Salvation. We're gonna move eight. So we're gonna move three. I'm pretty sure I can make it 10. Uh, maybe not. So then we're going to cast Synergy for two, and we'll allocate those. We're going to give one to this Crusader. Synergy's only two now, eh? Uh, yeah, it's only two. The second one to this Crusader, uh, actually to the Templar. He'll then move. He can move eight right now because of mobility. He's going to go hang out over here. 
And he's just gonna cast Convection for two onto this little fella, because why not? Okay, so uh, allocating those two to this Crusader and this other Crusader. 14 against Magic Ability 6. Let's see what we got. That's a 15. Five. That's gonna be three to the two. All right, Choir is going to activate. Um, we are going to move. So we're gonna go six, but not quite six. You don't need to be quite six. I'm go to here. Uh, we'll go to here. We'll go to just tuck in between these guys so that I can see Fire Salvation. Uh, and then he'll go this way, like so. We're going to do, uh, do I want to do battle? Or do I just want to do no shooting at me? I want to do no shooting at me. So we're going to do no shooting at him, Fire Salvation, him and him. Activates Mr. Fire Salvation. Um, he's just going to advance. He's gotten all nudged around. But. Yeah, we're just going to advance to here. In base to base, although we can't quite hug each other because I'm going to get pushed back an inch. Um, I'm going to use one to activate my imprint. I think that's actually sort of my activation, but because all my attacks boostedness. Initial melee with the mace. Seven. Seven's a hit. Uh, it's going to miss. Unless you're not eight. I'm you, not. You used to be seven. I'm so. still seven. Okay. Um, I'm going to not hit with my fist in my initial. I'm just going to buy a mace attack. Okay. Because otherwise, seven. I get pushed. Um, hits. Crit fire, if anything. Yeah. Um, and then. 18, so dice. Uh, you didn't battle, that's right. No. Dice plus one. Dice plus one. Seven to six, Gosh. and I slide an inch, and now it's my base again. I'll just buy another one, because I'm not going to bother trying to hit you with a fist, because it's just worse. Boosted hits. hits. Still crit fire. Dice plus dice one. Plus one. Ten. Movement and left arm is done, and now I'm pushed back an inch again, so I'm two inches away. So I'm actually right there. Synergy at plus one. So the next dude will be plus one, plus one. Um, we're going to activate this little fella, and he is going to charge. He's currently speed lots. Does he want to charge or does he want to trample? He wants to trample, actually, um, and he is going to trample this direction. I can always pre-measure. I can trample nine. Uh, nine right now, so lots. So I'm just going to trample. You don't push me back ever. Nope. It just can't be charged. So I'm going to trample with an inch, Whoop. like so. One to trample. Uh, and we're gonna start macing and punching. So you're deaf. We're gonna buy a mace. Ah uh, yes, yeah, yeah. So buying a mace tack. Deaf bad. Deaf bad. I'm Not seven. seven right now. So fours. Yeah. That'll hit. And Nine. then nineteen. Minus two. Minus two. Oh wait. Minus one. Okay. So eight to six. Seven to six. Actually, because you're twenty-one. He was looking at the defender for some reason. There you go. Second swing. It's, it's gonna hit. Minus and then one. dice minus one. Minus two, actually, 21, yeah? Right. So one to five. Synergy up to two. Yep. So, how we want to do this? You have the fortifying. So you kind of want to trample as well, but you have trample in straight lines. So that's not as good. So what you're going to do instead is walk six. Or you can run six. You do have parry. Or you can run 12, actually. Um, you're going to run 12. So you're gonna run eight to there, Oop. and then four more. My defender. And your defender, yeah, and just jam him up. He'll have a focus on it, he can't do anything with. And actually we'll be back an inch like that. I was gonna go, he's gonna charge Versh. He has a nine inch charge right now and a two inch reach. My path here with Owen, I can fit between these two because I know they're two inches apart and I have parry because I'm in the battle group. So I'm gonna place my Templar running right there to engage Mr. Hammersmith. There. Also be done with one focus on him. We're gonna activate this Crusader, and he's gonna go six and go stand next to you and base to base the flag and start swinging. Seven, I'm at eight right now. So I hit you automatically. I might as well save this for the boost. Hey guys, don't yeah. like that. <laughs> I'm actually just gonna buy a Maybe. base attack because this is just better because you're gonna push me back anyway. And it'll hit. Um, and then pow, 20 right now, yep. He dies. He only has four boxes. Okay. Even with the terrible roll. It doesn't matter if he dies or not, I'm still pushed back an inch, whoop, which is off the flag, which is inconvenient, but such is life. All right, well, these fellows are going to go, and they are going to charge Versh. Uh, so I have a 6 plus 3 plus 2 is 11, so this guy's definitely in range, because that's 10. So I'm going to put him at max melee. He's definitely in the range as well. So I'm going to go to there. He's definitely in range as well. Whoop. So I'll go to there. That's where they're max. Uh, he's just gonna run. Go sit on the flag. 
We're gonna combine. Um, so I'll need a five to hit here. Let's see if we get it. We do. He's dead. Um, and POW 10, 13 boosted lots. Yeah, so he's dead. All right, and then we're gonna go run and touch the flag, because of course we are. So my Hierophant, he's gonna go, or sorry, my Hierophant, my um, Vassal. He's gonna go walk over here, and he's gonna empower this guy for an extra one. He's gonna aim, and he's gonna take a shot into your defender, needing nines. First one hits. Um, it is POW 13, no, 12. 12, that's right, I didn't battle. Um, and do I want to boost that? Dice off six. Dice off six, I might as well boost it. See what we can do here. That's gonna be 11, so five to four. I need a nine again. Gonna miss, it's going to go to the red's direction. Five, six inches, the wall does nothing. Last shot, looking for a nine. Six, so again direction, We're looking for, that's more like it, three inches of the one. Looks like a hit. Okay, so we're gonna hit that journeyman. We're gonna boost the damage. It's minus eight, so I need a big number here to kill him. Uh, that's an 11, which would kill him. No, actually it it's three. Not. I'm just gonna reboost and remove zero, it, because yeah. you have no damage. That makes no sense. That. Makes the sense. So Get your focus back. Free. Mm, yep. Uh, we'll upkeep and have two left, and he's gonna give one more and sit on one. And upkeep for free, which will be Lightning Shroud. Yep. And everyone's gonna get one focus. For power up. Battle group. One. No, I'm keeping sidekick on Jake's. He'll get one for free. We'll give him a second one, and she'll sit on one. Looks good. And then allocating, uh, we're gonna give one to him. Jake's turn, or Finch turns it into two. Then we're gonna give one to him, and Finch turns it into two. Uh, she'll turn it into two. Okay, so we're more gonna focus. use a corpse token. Sounds good. The train's gonna go. He's just gonna kind of tuck bump in up against these guys, like so, and then he's gonna make a spear attack against the. Um, Crusader. Crusader. Yep, yeah, dev 10. Mat 7 needs a 3. Cranks it. Okay. Not a crit. Arm 21 right now because of Fortify. Dice minus 1. He does 7 to 1. 7 to 1. Up. Shield dash needs a 3. Hits. Gets it. Pow is 16, so dice minus uh, 5 right now. 2 to 4. Minus spear attack. Hits. Okay. Still no crit. Uh, dice minus 1. He does 8, eight to, to 1. one. I'm use Electro Leap because it needs box cards for anybody here. So I'm buying another one. Hits. Dice minus one. Not one one to one. two. One to two. This arm's broken. And oops, sorry, my movement's now broken too. Buying last attack. And seven, eight more to your one. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And still got six boxes left. Well done. So then caster goes next, and we buff the hammer smith to make him dice off two. He's gonna go. He's gonna reload. Okay, reload Nemo. Right. To notice that I control this flag and therefore I go second and have a control point. He's gonna go. She is going to move six and she only has one gun. So she'll go three, uh, four, and just, ah, uh, we'll go all the way. Five, six in the back. Sounds good. So rat goes to seven because I'm behind you, so okay. I need a six. Cranks Hits. it. Pow 12, so you die. Okay, him and he gets mad. Moving Hunter's on up. gonna walk up base to base with Jake's, and he's going to gunshot your uh Duder. That guy. Go for it. Seven death twelve. Five. Hits. Hits. Half armor, so eight. Plus two to ten. Doesn't matter, so just he's dead. Or he goes to dying. Dice off four. Yeah. Gets him. Yeah. Okay. Down and mad. Killbot's gonna charge. I don't like this plan, but it's the plan that we got. Okay. Uh, your legs are probably broken. Sure thing. Hit. I'll hit. <laughs> Pass 17, that's yep. off four. You got it. What boxes do you have left? Six. You have your cortex? Uh, yep. All right. Uh, so on hit, you take a damage to your cortex. Sure do. I do believe it's on hit. Yep. So you'll take one of your cortex before I roll. This is the okay. crippled guy too, remember? Y yeah, oh, I know. All right. Okay, I got no cortex boxes left. Nice off four. <gasps> He's dead. He has five. Okay. Exactly enough. Exactly enough. Okay, well, that's going to proc um, Vengeance from Blessing Avenge, or sorry, um, this guy, Fire Salvation. This is a friendly faction model got killed, so he's going to move three and make a melee attack. Uh, vengeance happens in your maintenance phase? Not, I'm sorry, it's not Vengeance, it's immediately. It's a, it's Holy Fervor or something like that. Sorry, it was called something different, so I didn't think it was actually regular Vengeance. But yeah, no, he'll go in my maintenance phase. Okay. He is going to just walk and engage both of these guys. Sounds good. He's going to punch him in the back. So, Fisto. Smacks, one damage to your Cortex. Okay. 
And then POW 17 against armor 19, because you don't get your this shield the from fist behind. Or the, uh, this is the fist or the hammer? Uh, this is the Templar. Yeah, yeah, so you're using your hammer. You don't have a fist, you have a gun. Got right. it. Okay, keep going. And so dice minus two. He does six to two. Okay. Except. Hits, one your cortex. Okay. And then dice minus two. He does six to one. Okay. This is consistent. And we just broke your shield anyway. Do uh, you have any left? I have three. Oh, yeah, it's right, yeah, okay. Yeah, so by an attack, he's actually going to hit this fella here now. Okay. So he's hitting the other Crusader. Hits. Uh, hits, because you're only deaf 10. Mm -hmm. So 19. one to your cortex. Okay. And then dice minus two. He does four to three. Four to three. I am. Last one. Same guy. Okay. Hits. hits. And then dice minus two. Six to four. Six to four. There we go. Finch are going to go. Uh, Finch is just going to advance to there. And Nemo is going to... I can't shoot this one, right? Nope. Okay. Um, I could have just shot those guys with Nemo. Whatever, he'll just stay where he is. <laughs> okay. He'll move up a little slight bit. And then he is going to cast um, Lightning Shroud off of him and onto him. Okay. And then he's just going to camp too. Just going. He's going to just walk to here. Base to base, and he's gonna make his initial melee. Okay. So he is Matt, pretty good. Seven. So not snake eyes. Hits. So you get beat back an inch. And I follow up an inch. And then it's POW 19, so dice damage. Nine to one. Nine to one gone, yeah, nine to one. Second Next one. Initial. Hits. Hits. So you get beat back an inch. Follow up an inch. And then dice damage, roll low. Good. Four to two. <laughs> this is left. Uh, I hit with both my initials, so yep. chain attack smite. Uh, I hit again. Okay. And so you get slammed uh, d6. Two, two inches. Which puts you back. Oh, I knocked that guy. And I'm right here. No, you're straight ahead, right? Yep. Yeah. Do five and I'm dead. Four. Oh. Attack. Yep. Uh, auto hits. So Go you for it. push back again. I'm gonna follow up. I don't think I made it though. Nope. Uh, so I auto hit, and yeah. it's auto damage, so you just die. Just die, yeah. Two, two boxes. You gonna go? He's just going to advance to here. And be awesome. Okay. And then I think that's my turn. Yeah. Super big so deal. There, I forgot there to do we go. Attack. Oh, because Finch needed to melee me? Because then you'd be disrupted. Oh, that would be true. All right, so my maintenance phase. Right, Finch is gonna go off. Um, before I power everybody up, I get to move three and make a melee attack. So I'm going to, I have parry, so I can just move three. I don't want to hit, I have hit you before. I don't want to kill the hammersmith. I'm pretty sure these two guys can finish off the hammersmith. So yeah, let's go deep. I'm gonna go over here, like this. Punch Mr. Hammersmith. Yeah. Um, Def 12, five. I'm at seven, so fives. Cranks gonna it. do it. Armor 21 still. Okay, so dice off three. It's gonna be five to five. So everybody's gonna power up. Big time. I thought I was dead. All right, so I'm gonna not upkeep synergy this turn. I'm gonna allocate all my focus out, so two, two, two. We're gonna keep one over here. Um, and then we are going to... He's still within 12, right? Start and activate Mr. Raza. All right, so um, we are going to start our turn uh, with Mr. Raza. Hierophant. He's gonna, or Mr. Hereford, sorry. He's gonna <laughs> just dirtle I'll over walk here. You this. Thanks so much. And he's gonna harmoniously exalt him. Uh, then we're gonna pull one off this rack and activate Raza on a three. It doesn't blow up. Nope, it doesn't blow up. Um, then we're gonna cast Synergy again for one. And he is going to charge this Hammersmith, but remain in base to base with this flag. Come at me, bro. Just in case something goes terribly wrong. And he's gonna trip you for. Because and, of course. and we don't do it. Um, but such is life, it just means you're standing up. It's not very hard to hit you anyway. Choir, they're gonna walk up six to here. Bam. That's right, so we're gonna walk up six. I don't think that last guy's gonna No, be. he's not gonna quite make it to here in battle, so we're not gonna be able to battle that guy. We're gonna walk, uh, sorry, actually we're gonna just change that operation, then we're gonna go to this one over here, and then you know, we're just gonna go stand over here so that he can go. Remember, they're only commands. Over so there. Yeah. And battle. Battled, battled, and battled. Couldn't quite make it to him. He's going to go, and he's just going to power up this little guy. Yeah. Activating over here. Uh, he is going to charge this Hammersmith. Whoop, like that. Actually, he doesn't even need to charge. We're not going to bother charging. We're just going to walk in. There you go. Because I can buy more attacks. Hit with the first one. Misses. 
fist. Hits. Hits. Armor 19. Um, armor 19, so that's 14, which 16. means dice off the hand is 14. Oh, battle for 16, that's right. So off dice three. off three. That's gonna be six to three. Dying one, synergy doesn't go up yet. So we're gonna do Mr. Club. It's gonna hit. Uh, this plus is gonna one. be 20, so dice plus one. That's gonna be eight to one, buying another attack. Hitting on fours. Hits. Uh, hitting on fives. You're mad. Ten. Six. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. That's right. And that doesn't do anything except this is last one. We're not gonna get this now. Yeah, that's super nice. <laughs> yeah. So yes. hit finally and plus dice one. plus one. There we go. Thirteen to four. Right, over here, uh, we're gonna move in. Whoop, like so to Miss Jake's. Finch. Finch. Whatever her name is. What's her defense? Uh, fourteen. Fourteen. So I'll hit her on sevens right now. We're just gonna try and hit her with the hand. Gonna hit. Doesn't get her uh, against Dude Man Guy. Would have hit him anyway. This is with the club. Uh, do He's actually done 12, so you would have missed him as well. That's what I mean, so it wouldn't have mattered. You know what? Let's hit her again on a seven. Club. Hits this time. Crit fire. Nice. Yeah, she just explodes. Uh, now we're going to buy an attack on him. And this is whoa. That's just great. You're doing great, buddy. You're just fantastic. <laughs> Breaking apart the seams. <laughs> there we go. Um, and this is, sorry, Matt. Um, seven. You need seven. A five. Yeah. Make a five. It's gonna hit. No crit. And this is pow twenty. Oh, this one was 19. nineteen because of the thing. So it's plus one. So dice plus one. Ten to five. Second attack. Hitting on a five. Hits. Dice plus one. Dice plus one again. Uh, it's gonna be a nine to three. We'll attack. Let's see what we can do here. It's going to be a hit. And is your movement stop? Yeah. Okay. Plus dice one. plus one. It's gonna be 12 to six. It would have been really great if I remember to attack with Finch. Yeah. <laughs> that would have that been super relevant, yep. <laughs> um, so then we're going to activate Mr. Fire. Um, he's gonna use one of his initials to hit Mr. Hammersmith. Right, so um, first initial with the mace, I'm at mat nine right now because of synergy. So hitting, uh, I don't need to boost these. Threes, hits, hits, crit fire. Uh, I think I'm just, are you using your mace? I'm using my mace, yeah. So you're power 22 right yep. now, so he's just dead. Okay. That was the hammer stuff, right? Yep. Crunch. Uh, second initial with the hand into shieldy guy. Centurion. Yep. Hits. It's gonna hit, and this is with the hand, so. 17, 18 right 17, now. 18, okay. Minus one, two, three, minus three. So five to one. Yeah. He's gone now, okay, so now I'm buying one with the mace. Yep. Let's do it. It's gonna hit. Dice. Uh, you're power 22, so dice plus 22, three. 22, dice plus three. That's gonna be nine to six. Buy one, buy another one. Does it hit? It Bad. does, and you're done. All right, so having to walk with this fella. I'm gonna head over here. Yeah. Just touch this. Uh, we're gonna boost a shot. You're gonna bother boosting it. We're just gonna try and roll box cars. And then blast damage you. First one. Almost. <laughs> just need a low roll, so directions are relevant. I just need the white dice to be low. Nope. Second one going for box cars. Uh, nope. And low white. That's gonna still hit you. Yep. So we're gonna boost it. Damage eight. Damage armor six. Oh, you battled. Okay, I battled right. them. Yeah. Uh, armor fourteen. Okay. So dice minus six. Yep. Oh, Smith last shot. Not Doesn't hit cars. you and might do some damage, but you have a transfer thing. Not just too far. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna charge over here. Whoop. Who's he charging? Uh, her. Jake's. Yeah. So we're gonna go. Blop. And we're gonna go. Remember, you gotta move at least three to get the bonus. Yeah. If we can't, I don't think we're gonna get the bonus from anybody. But okay. Is does it matter for combine who gets the bonus? It's three, and then they'll combine with them. Okay. Sidekick. I need an eight here to get this. Oh! Hang time. Okay. <laughs> What's your uh, arm? It's pal 13 against armor 13. Okay. So roll a 10. Mm, I do. And he does. And she's dead. Focus comes back. And it sure does. Uh, you dominate to three. That's right. Yep. I'm on Whoop. seven. Big on Hammersmith. And we're going to drop armor, our arcane shield because yep. it's not going to save me anyway. Uh, yeah, I don't have anything to allocate. So reload. Lock up. Reload. Uh, he's going to go. Do it. I have feet. Okay. Shoot your gas. He doesn't have stealth, right? Nope. We talked about this. Yep, yeah, yeah, no stealth, just deaf good. He needs an eight to hit me. Gets, Gets it. it. Uh, it is pow, 12, I believe. Okay, arm 14. Uh, yeah, boosting it to four dice, so you get dice minus two. Uh, that's a lot. That's gonna be 13. 
That was a three. That goes to a one. So that would be a... 10, 14 damage. 14 damage. So I've got some left. D3 times. Three. And that goes, I believe, closest. It's going to go bat and then bat. Yeah. Yep. So he's over right. 19. Yep. Uh, dice minus seven. Did you roll the D3 already? I did. I rolled okay. three. Okay, gotcha. going to hit these two. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, so you take five to three. One here. Dice minus seven. Yeah, it's another gonna be five to two. Five to two. Gone. So he's dead. That's relevant. Oh, well. And he is within five inches. Again? Go for it with reload. Boost to hit. This is it. You gotta do it. Roll, Roll that eight. This is the game. Gets, Gets it. I'm dead. Uh, dice minus two. Boost the damage. There's no way to live. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> this might be relevant. I'm actually tough. Five plus, I don't die. No. Oh, Raza almost did it. Um, yeah, that you was crazy. Just assassinated me I should have. I, I forgot. I could just have walked around you and meleeed you. But Actually, I don't even think you needed to do the bonus movement. No. It's speed five. Yeah. So you're like, I walk. And I have parry right now. So I just inches, go two inches. Two inches. And, and then, then one inch. One inch. Oh, maybe you would have had to do it. Yeah. Maybe look at it. It was a very close game. Um, I was at three points. I would have won next turn if you hadn't killed me anyway. So such, such is the nature of War Machine. Gotta say, I did like... Um, both Nemo's ability to be a jackcaster now because of Jake's being able to allocate all the time and extra Finch. focus. Or sorry, yeah. Finch, that's right, yeah. Um, and of course, Amon is just an amazing, Great. amazing jackcaster. <laughs> like, ridiculous jackcaster. So, I might paint some more Crusaders. All right, so there it was, 75 points, Menoth versus Signar, and it ended in caster kill. Um, yeah, I there was some points where I just got confused by my order of operations, and I think that's what won me the, or lost me the game. Because I, I thought for sure like, for the start of my turn, I was like, I'm just going to kill your caster. I even said it. And then I killed, him. what's his name? The yeah, Centurion right, instead. Centurion and then Defender. Yeah, I don't know why I did it. I don't know why I did it. I thought I, you were just going to walk past and go for... That's what I was, that's what I was planning on doing at the beginning of the turn. I was just going to build up synergy off the first two and then go walk over and be like, one focus for everything boosted and then squash you and I forgot to. Because sometimes I, you forget caster there's, kills. There's a chance I win. Yep. Because uh, I was armor 19. So you're rolling like maybe dice plus one or two and then I'm reducing by five. So, the thing was the net result of my my fighting from the other two crusaders wouldn't have mattered, because right. I could spend all my focus. I could just fill up what's his name, yeah. and then uh, drop uh, what call it. I'll keep synergy, fill up what's his face, and then yeah, put up mobility, cool. and then he can just walk around behind you and be like one uh, one to boost. Well, sorry, get behind Centurion yeah, yeah. to where Nemo is, and then just once everything's boosted and crush. Yeah, crush. He's got four chances to do it. Four to hit, and then. How would be 20... I would have battled him first, too. 23? Yeah. Dice plus 4? With, with crit fire. With fire. <laughs> plus 4? Yeah, you probably kill him. Yeah, exactly. Because then you roll like a 13. Because it's 4. I'd be, I'd be matting 9 going in. You'd be matting 10. Uh, if I managed to hit with Raza, yes. Yeah. If Raza had hit, I would have been at 10. you should have hit, on I'd, average. Yeah, yeah. on threes. <laughs> Not even on average. On on <laughs> Wasn't on four? Yeah. I'm at, at seven? You're at seven to my def 11. Oh, that's right, Because we're marginally yeah. better. That's right, Mar marginally better than my heavies. Um, and that would have been, that I would have been a smarter play. I would have just not gotten lost in trying to clean up these Warjacks. Sometimes that happens, though, when a bunch of Warjacks come to your Warjacks and red, like wreck them, and you get like the red haze what comes down. What I should down. have done is not followed up <laughs> with that last attack, yeah. my beat back. I should have just stood still, and then you couldn't fit between them. Yep, absolutely. Yeah, there's no I realized it immediately after I did it too, and I'm like, ah, I've already done it. Or, or I would have had to kill him first right. to do it, which, which would have been but way you harder. having to kill him means you don't get the focus, yep. which means yeah. someone has to do something else, and Finch forgetting to attack, and whatever. Games. Mark three. Yep. Mark <laughs> I, I don't know if I'd change too much in this list. I think I might swap out. I like the Redeemer because she could re reach out and touch. I liked the little unit of Flame Guard with the two Seneschals because they were dangerous. Like you have to deal with them and they can go get the other flag. Because really often when I play two flag missions, I don't know what to send home, what to leave at home. Right. When you have a wall of Warjacks, it has to stay together. You're, you're going to send that after something. You know what I mean? And But your your marginal force is usually just garbage. But Clearly, the two Seneschals... You just need more Warjacks. Uh, that's, that's the thing. Yeah, he, He's encouraging me to just go all Warjacks all the time. My, my other thought is, because I've seen this caster now with mobility, taking Harkovich, because my other army, of course, is Kador with three Juggernauts, three Destroyers, and um, uh, what's it, a Kodiak. And then just some uh, War Dog and some Repair Guys. Because then I've got Broadside Mobility, which means that I can aim, and he gives this whole battle group reposition three. So they can aim, fire, move three, and they can creep forward the first couple turns, or even just run the first turn with Mobility, which is going to be a 12-inch run, and then just creep around aiming with their guns, and he can broadside. So six shots per turn with POW 14 AOE 4s, 
and then no you, parry is you, a big deal. You come, it is a big deal, but you come near, you're coming to me in that one. You know what I mean? And then it's Juggernauts plus what's his I face? I play the Rosal list against that every day of the week. I think the Rosal list would be the most I would have a problem with, <laughs> to be honest with yeah, you, because because the, the Rosal list is like. Go ahead, Pop 14s, we don't care, we're gonna get to you. Yeah. <laughs> Mobility you against might, mobility. Might two of us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's 10, 10 Crusaders, because yeah. that's what you want to do, is 10 other. Crusaders I and a Hierophant. 10. 10 Crusaders, 10 Crusaders and a Hierophant. And one rack. And one rack. It's, it's a list we just made up, and it sounds amazing. That's what I want to bring. I have three Crusaders painted, and I have two more that I can put together, and I'll have five. I have three painted, and yeah. I have another one. Yeah. Yeah, and I'll have five then. Um, but I think I would keep in Fire Salvation. He's great just for, especially with Synergy, because he's a bit more accurate in the first one, getting the Synergy to build, or as the final guy for a Synergy, because he's speed five. So with Parry, a seven inch walk gets him almost anywhere to go do things. Um, or if he needs to, he can do a trample through a line at top Synergy as well to get to where he needs to go for one focus and doesn't even have to boost. Um, and then parries are relevant. Yep. So, uh, or actually parries are still relevant because I don't kill you with the trample. No, you don't get a free strike from that. Oh, not it's anymore? anyone nearby. I thought that was, oh, it's the only guys nearby, yeah, yeah, yeah. But regardless, I can, that parry means I can trample through Perry's lines really and I do anything. That's what we're trying to say. It is really, really good, and it does make you better slightly than Harkovich. Um, but then, that's why I think I would keep the Redeemer in, because then you have something that can reach out and touch stuff and I shoot 16 inches. In it. 10. Half Probably again. a lot of dervishes. 15? 15 dervishes? 14. A lot of dervishes? You're not quite. Or, or what were the Fisto guys? Take the Fisto Vigilance. guys instead. Yeah, but they're more expensive now. Yeah. And way pillow fisted. Like, they have Vigilance, or sorry, dervishes can combo strike ah. at like POW 15 or 16. And because they cap synergy. It would be good if they didn't cap synergy. It would be like old Bradigus well, good almost. The thing does Dickery is LF sidestep. Yeah. So like and parry now too. Be, well, they have parry already. Yeah. Actually. They no, sidestep doesn't give you parry anymore. No, no, they they, they have, have it naturally. Parry. Okay. Yeah. 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 So you could just send this like wave <laughs> of mat seven because they're mat seven too. So mat ten with yep with mat synergy 10, up maxed out fifteen or sixteen with uh, just their attacks yep. and you just be hitting them with like waves. Yep. I don't know. Can they trample? No, no, because they're, they're only lights. Okay, slam. Yeah, yeah. They can knock down bigger guys yeah, and push yeah. them around. I have a feeling that these heavy jack lists, especially uh, Amon in particular, are going to become really, really popular. Because <laughs> they're pretty easy to manage, all things considered, because you don't have a lot of models. Yep. And they're crazy fast, and they're really durable. Like, having a squad of Warjacks is yeah, crazy. Um, there's a lot of things that, that cause problems for them. Yep. Like, any kind of decent infantry is an issue. Yep. Um, like you don't want to fight against like Iron Fang Pikemen. Nope, absolutely he'll not. Charge you three at a time, knock you down and do damage, yep. and then you'll kill those guys, and then he'll charge you again yep. and knock you down and do. That's damage. actually one cool thing about uh, Harkovich. He has jump start, so for one, everything is controller and just stands up, yep. which is huge if that happens to you. Um, you don't have that luxury, Stay obviously, but feet, stuff like that. Yeah. Um, there's stuff. It's the shock and awe. You know what I mean? Is what it is. It's ten warjacks coming it's towards you. It's having three hundred. It's box. it's the yeah, and that's, it's that's it, what it is. It's whatever whatever the gimmick is that usually slows other armies down. Three hundred and twenty boxes can probably survive and still be effective afterwards, especially if they can walk six. Especially because they parry. Made it so you can shake everything. There's and you no can shake it. Yeah, exactly. That you that you, right that you can't shake off. Except for like the continuous effects, but like yeah. blind, uh, stationary, knockdown. Like They're not as crippling as they were. They were yeah. they were they were turn ending in previous editions. Yeah, but now you can just be like, okay, hey, everybody shakes with the free focus. With the free focus, and then and it's just working out. Okay. One, she's like, I feet, ha ha, and yeah. you're like, everybody shakes. Yeah. And then we doesn't even matter. It's just it's then just I a focus. Drain. Everybody won. <laughs> yeah, it's a focus drain in your warjacks because if you're not taking infantry, then the warjacks don't want to care, and they just walk it off. Yep. Um, and of course, steady and tough on Amon's a huge deal too, because five plus you just don't lose the game. Yep. Like that could have been that could, that could have been it. Yeah, exactly. Well, over and over again. Was gonna just go after you. That was the play. For sure. Yeah. yeah. Junior was gonna snipe the uh, choir member, and then yeah. I was just gonna take the free strike and walk in with. Actually, I don't even think I need to take a free strike. I think he just walks up and yeah. defenders you three times, four times, three times because I'm gonna have to boost, two times because I'm gonna have to boost. Yep. That was the play. That was the play. Doing it the works. game tape on just lightning bolt you. <laughs> that's the downside of this is the downside though, and that's what I yeah. said originally was the problem is people are just gonna kill Raza. Yep. Because he's not that hard to kill. Yep. 16 14 is a bad stat line. Like really bad. He's good because he is steady. But, but not no stealth, no, no way to gain tech. stealth. Yeah. yeah. Unless there's some handy walls near a flag you can go hide behind so he's defense twenty, then it's a then it's a big deal. Then it's okay. <laughs> yeah. Defense twenty is pretty great. And yeah. steady, so you can't be knocked down, so you're never reducing it. There's a lot of ways to get around that, though. And there's a lot of guns that ignore cover and That's stuff true. like that. Yeah. So, Templates I mean, and stuff. it's true. It's good. Don't get me wrong. That's the way to do it is hide behind a wall. But there's no way to... Well, a Vigilant will do it, too. You could buy a Vigilant to you have him stand next to you. Nine and one Vigilant. Yep. 
and then, and then he's mobile guarded cover. Too. Yeah, and then he's guarded as well, guarded which is huge. No, no blast either. Yeah, because so you that's, can die from blast. We're only armor 14. That's right. Like, yeah, if yeah. I brought a redeemer, I can just shoot you all yeah. game. And to, like, to make that many war decks effective, he is going to be using his focus every single turn. So you're not going to have the, the damage reduction that you would normally have on a focus camping caster. He's just going to keep spending uh, it out. What's it called? Mobility. Mobility, yeah. Yeah, so uh, the racks were definitely an auto-include, at least one, you know, and yeah. then if you've only got the one, putting it somewhere laterally to your battle line where he's always going to be in range of it probably so you can keep pulling from it until it dies, um, that's a huge deal. Okay, um, I needed two. But one on the backboard. I had an extra one, point. One 12 inches there's, there's nothing else for one point, you know what I mean? So it's like sometimes you just take them because you have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just thinking, like, how I would organize my list. Right. Which is different, of course, better than mine. Well, really. <laughs> I lost, so I'll be honest. Yeah. <laughs> See, I was on the way to victory that game. That's I right. I just baited you That's in. right. That's what happened. That's why, That's why you're tilting so hard at the end of the game. Yeah. I was tilting because you can roll. <laughs> All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We'll see you more um, uh, in the future for more Whole New War. We're going to be tinkering with our lists, adding some stuff to our existing armies, and I'll potentially be starting a new one. Um, I want to do some hordes at some point. I have a Legion army. But Mike's doing Legion. I have a Circle army, but I'm just not I excited to paint army. it. Yeah, I have a Scorn army, too. Actually, I have a bunch of Scorn stuff. If you want it, you can have it. Eh. I have a bunch of Scorn stuff. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see. Um, discuss if we got anything wrong that you've noticed in the comments. Obviously, this is our first time. My first time playing Man off this edition. Um, this is your first time playing Nemo 3. Ever. No, I played Nemo. Oh, played, I oh, was, um, a Dark Horse Wait, who, was, who was the one that you hadn't played? It was uh, uh, the last game we played. It was No, it no. wasn't Sloan. It was um, Striker, two. Striker 2. That's right. Yeah, Striker 2 that you hadn't played before. No, I played Nemo 3 all day in the tournament. There you go. For funsies. Just I'm for like, funsies. Hey, Vale, I'm going to kill you on turn 2. And he's like, No, you're not. I'm like, Yeah, I am. <laughs> Shot his Carnivian and killed And then he did. Or Ravagor. <laughs> what, what's the. It doesn't matter. Ra Ravager? Ravagor? No, it's the, the shooty one. The, no, it was the the claw one. Oh, Scythian. Scythian. Yeah. He's like, I'm def 11. I'm like, I hit him, bounced to Veil. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's still. I can still boost it in the previous edition. Yeah. So it's four dice damage against your armor, 14. Whoa. And then I do it twice. Oh, <laughs> gross. And then the defender shot her. So anyway, we'll see you for another one of these soon. Until then, I'm Ash's own. That's what we're going to